face, Mahmoud Athabata. I am a freshman at Harvard College and a Palestinian first year. So I'm here today for my family and uh, my siblings in Gaza and the rest of Palestine. With the ongoing genocide that's going on right now, Harvard is materially and morally complicit, and we demand disclosure and divestment into uh, its money aiding and abetting this ongoing genocide, occupation, and apartheid. Right now behind me, you're seeing people chanting uh, free Palestine and for Palestinian liberation. Uh, the moods are very high right now, and community is going uh, extraordinary. We have a supply tent. We have a lot of tents where people are sharing. I am, um, I'm personally sharing a tent with a couple of people that I didn't know that we've gotten to know each other pretty well. People are doing their homework. Uh, people are singing. People are painting signs, uh, and people are playing music. There's, it's just a, a really nice community vibe. We are all Beautiful. It really is. Like as a Muslim, like seeing this prayer space set up and seeing people praying, and um, you know some of the folks in the encampment like holding up kufiyas to to pr protect that identity and you know make sure that people have that space to practice. Like that just blows my mind. Like, it's been cold. It's been wet. It's been very emotionally difficult at times. It's also such an incredible community of people who care deeply about each other and who care deeply for Palestine and for Gaza. And um, we hold each other close and have a lot of love and respect. And we're really all united um, in our fight for a free Palestine. And that's why we show up. I'm a member of HGSU, Harvard Graduate Students Union. And I believe that what we're doing right here is protected by uh, concerted activity. Um, I think that the vast majority of people at this university are in solidarity with us in, in various ways. Um, we've been receiving like floods of texts, like donations, food drops coming in. Our encampment is going strong. We're having such a powerful movement today. And this community is one that's built on love and li collective liberation. The central story here is not students are creating encampments. The central story is not even students are facing repression for creating encampments. The central story is that there is a genocide going on in Gaza. I hope that we can center our attention there, even as this very exciting and interesting and novel and perhaps scary thing is happening here in the yard. You know, I think it's a small part of a global movement for a free Palestine. It's not about any one encampment at any one school or any one elite institution. It really is part of a global movement, and I see myself um, and the students here as doing our small part. I think that we're just a drop in the bucket, and drops add up to waves and oceans, and the more waves there are, the, more, the bigger difference we can make. And I'm just a small part in it, but I know that Harvard divesting is going to make a difference, and Harvard must divest now.